Today we are going to discuss one of the utility of a Terraform that is Terraform version manager and uh, this will help you to manage the different version of a Terraform which you can run and install onto your development machine. This utility Terraform version manager doesn't come default with a Terraform. You need to install this utility explicitly after installing the Terraform. But you might be wondering like why do we need to have a Terraform version manager? So as a typical software development cycle, Terraform releases the new versions of a Terraform, which either include bug fixes and the new feature. But sometimes what happens is like with the newer version of a Terraform, some of the provider or some of the plugins or the existing stable plugin doesn't work. So in such scenario, you either need to roll back your Terraform version or if you are running some older version of a Terraform, then in that case, you need to upgrade your Terraform version. So in such kind of a scenarios where providers and plugins are not compatible with the latest version of a Terraform, then in that case, you can use the Terraform version manager to roll back or either upgrade your Terraform version. Well, this is just an example which I'm just talking about, but you can either roll back, you can either upgrade your Terraform version. So I think this utility is a really good to have and you must install this utility along with your Terraform. Let's switch over to desktop and see how we can install Terraform version manager. As I have already told you, Terraform version manager doesn't come default with the Terraform. You need to install this utility separately. And this is the GitHub page uh, which you can follow and I'll also show you like how you can install it. So I'll put the link of this GitHub page into the description section. So once you open this page and if you'll follow along with the instruction, then you will find the respective instructions for Mac OS and Linux. If you are using Mac OS and you are a fan of a brew, then you can just copy this command to install onto Mac operating system. Or else, if you are using a Linux operating system, then I would recommend using this uh, instruction where you need to clone the GitHub repository and then you need to uh, transfer the executable into the pen directory. I'm just gonna use, although I'm using the Mac operating system, but I can pretty much follow these instructions for installing the Terraform version manager. I'm not just gonna use the brew. I'm just simply gonna follow this manual way of installing the Terraform version manager. So I'm just gonna start with the cloning the GitHub repo of a Terraform version manager. Copy this link over here, go to terminal and paste it over here. It will just clone the GitHub repo. Second, it will export the uh, environment variable or add to bash profile. So I'm just gonna copy this command and paste it over here. After that, there is a one more command uh, for bash rc so i'm just gonna copy it it is also exporting the path and i'm just gonna paste it over here and once you're done with these commands then you can run the command tfenv v that will verify the version which you have installed so here you can see the version which i have installed is 3.0.0 after installing the terraform version manager let's run some terraform version manager commands to verify the available versions of a terraform so the command which i'm just gonna run is terraform env list remote and here you can see it is giving you the list of a version. So these are the versions which is available for you for installing the Terraform. So here you can see uh, this will start from I think the very basic or the first version of a Terraform and it will go all the way to the latest version that is 1.3.0 alpha. And here you can see the latest uh, stable version is 1.2.6. So here you can see, uh, I mean, it will show you all the available versions of Terraform till the date. Now let's assume you want to install some older version of a Terraform, then how can you do that using the Terraform version manager? So the command which you need to use is Terraform env, then followed by install and the version. So I'm just gonna install the version 2. Point, uh, let's say four. And here you can see it has installed the Terraform version 1.2.4. One more interesting thing, you can install multiple version of a Terraform using Terraform version manager and you can set which one to use it. So I'm just gonna install one more version that is 1.2.3. And after that, uh, we will tell Terraform environment, ter Terraform version manager to use one, 1.2 point, uh, let's say three. And here you can see it is switching the version from uh, the 1.2.6 to 1.2.3. And if you're not sure like which version of a Terraform you should install and you want to install the latest version of a Terraform, then what you can do, you can simply run the command tfenv followed by install and then you can just simply supply, apply the latest. So it will install the latest stable version of a Terraform onto your system. 
Also, the good thing about this Terraform version manager is you can install multiple version of a Terraform, but you can explicitly tell Terraform version manager to use which version of a Terraform. So here you can see I have uh, tell Terraform version manager to use 1.2.6. So already I have installed 1.2.3 as well as 1.2.4. So I have the multiple version which is already installed, but I can tell like just to use the 1.2.6 which I want to uh, run onto my machine. So these are the benefits of using Terraform version manager. I hope you liked the today's short session on how to manage the different version of a Terraform using the Terraform version manager. And if you are interested into the similar content on a DevOps then considering subscribing to this channel where I keep on sharing the similar content on a weekly basis. And if you have any comments or suggestions then those are also welcome. You can put down into the comment section. See you into the next session of our DevOps. Till then take care and bye bye.